how to store your images the right way. Take a look what I am doing. I'm taking the card and I put it in the in this device and now I have all the images here. Here is the images that I took today in Wokadahachi. Now, this is the A, this is the B, and this is the C. I took close to 3,000 pictures. Now, here is the box, my original box that I am storing all the images in it. And after I store all the images in this box, the way it is, I didn't go through them yet. I copy them to another box. To this one. And this is the one that is going to store all the images with the blurry, with everything. This is eight terabyte and all the images store like this. Take a look. You see, January, February, March, and this is the original. So yesterday I went to Wokadahachi. Here is all the images. And last month, here is all the images by the day. And after this, after I store all the images on my hard drive, extended hard drive, and I have a copy here, and I have the original here, then I work with this program, then I have it since 2005. It's calling Microsoft Expression Media 2. And this has helped me to organize all the images. I show you like February. Take a look. On February, I was 28 days in Wokadahachi. Every day I went in another place and I took pictures, approximately around 750 pictures every day. So here is all the images and it helped me to sort through the images and make my artwork. For more information, you're welcome to contact me. Visit YouTube Surreal Nature on Facebook, Mayor Martin. Thank you for watching.